السلام عليكم ورحمة الله وبركاته أعزائي طلاب الصف الثالث Hello dear students of grade 3 and welcome to a new lesson Our lesson today is from module 7 entitled as song The target of the lesson is to identify to identify fruit and to introduce countable nouns also to revise plurals plural nouns and as usual let's introduce ourselves to the new words and as you can see they are fruit all about fruit so I would like you to listen and repeat one two three Grapes. 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 Peach. Peach. Mango. 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 Pineapple. Pineapple Cherry Cherry Strawberry Strawberry All right, thanks a lot for listening and repeating. Now let's move to our next point. And please open your box to page number 85, student book. And you will see this. We have here a song or a poem. You will listen to it and you will do the matching. All right, as you can see, we have one, two, three, four, five, six, and seven. Okay, so all you have to do is to match the line to the to one of these fruit okay so let's start one two three two, two. listen and match then say fruit I'm hungry, what about you? Do you like fruit? There are some cherries and strawberries too. There are some grapes, do you want grapes too? You know they're good for me and you. I'm hungry, what about you? Do you like fruit? There is a pineapple and a mango too. I want a peach, do you want a peach too? You know it's good for me and you. I hope you did it right and do the matching. 
Now, let's move to the next step, which is about what you see. Let's read this. Plural nouns. Plural nouns. So this is the third or the second target for this lesson, which is talking about plural nouns. Let's read the examples here and see how to form the plural noun. All right. Look here, I have one cherry, one cherry, but if I have more than one cherry, I say cherries, cherries. Also here, one strawberry, one strawberry, but if I have more than one, I say strawberries strawberries also here i have one peach one peach but here i have three so i say peaches three peaches so what's the rule here how to form the plural of nouns it's very easy Look here, you have to memorize the rule and apply it. How? Look, most nouns, I add S to make the plural. For example, one boy. If I have more than one boy, I simply add S to the end of the noun okay to the end of the word it becomes for example three boys three boys another example here one book but if i have more than one like two here two books one book two books so i add s to the end of the word to the end of the noun now this is is this is the case with most nouns but if the nouns ending in o x sh ch s or double s I add ES, ES. Let's clarify that by reading this example. Look here, the word bus. It ends in S. So I add ES, not only S, I add ES. So one bus for buses buses look here to the word fox it ends in x so i form the plural by adding es e s foxes two foxes one fox two foxes all right now another ending here if you have nouns ending in consonant plus y consonant means the normal letters other than the vowels as you know we have five vowels and they are a, E, I, O, U. So these are the vowels. So we are not talking about them. We are talking about the normal letters 
the rest of the letters they are called consonant so if you have nouns ending in consonant plus y the letter y what i how do i form the plural i form it by deleting the y and adding i e s in another word the y becomes i e s look at this example here baby so baby it ends in consonant the letter b consonant and the letter y one baby two babies babies so the y becomes i e s city one city but two cities two cities one more time the y becomes i e s thank you very much that's it we come to the end of our lesson but before we go let's know our homework which is from the workbook page number 82 this page thank you very much for listening i hope you're the best all the time goodbye bye برعاية الله السلام عليكم ورحمة الله وبركاته